I'm disconnected or something. What? That's my arm! I love this boss. I can't wait to do more. I can't believe it! My heart is pounding! I'm free! This is Tall and Manly, my hard crying man that entered the world of Gelinor just over a year ago with one singular goal to get all of the best, highest level gear in the entire game for every combat style. In the last episode, we grinded Angel of Death to get ourselves our very first Praisal Codex and the Ruination Prayer to make my necromancy damage output just a little bit better. And we needed it to be a little bit better because I wanna grind Raziel until I have an entire full set of tier 95 gear. Unfortunately, with a boss like this that has seven unique tier 95 drops and no kind of bad luck mitigation or weighted drop system, it is extremely possible, and I would even go as far as to say plausible, that this video could be an extremely long one, and it could take an absolute ton of time to manage to get myself the full lot. With that said, a promise. This video will not end until I have completed the Razia log. I don't care if it takes me an entire month. We're gonna get this done no matter what. Before my slow, painful descent into literal insanity at Raziel, I need to tell you that if you're watching this video, you are probably not subscribed to my channel. And you could change that by hitting the subscribe button if you want to. Subscribing helps me out a lot because it tells the YouTube algorithm that you like what you're seeing and you wanna see more of it. Before I go back to Raziel though, there's one other thing I can do to increase my damage output just a tiny little bit. And that is the Reaper Crew buff. The Reaper Crew buff is given to a player that completes one kill at least at every single boss in the game. And looking at the list, I'm actually extremely close. So we're gonna start things off by getting that done really quick. And then hopefully my Raziel kills are about 1% faster. And over the course of potentially thousands of kills, hopefully that tiny difference adds up. All right, first boss done. Nicely done. Masuda cooked. ED1 is done. All right, well, ED2 time. Yeah, if there ever was one to go wrong, it would be this one, but let's get it. Dude, not having a hit caps is so easy. <laughs> Bye, Baraklith. That was the same speed as Astolard. Bonk. Nice. ED2 done. Snake's dead. All right, Terrigan's dead. <laughs> All right, and be down. What? Look at the damage we just did. Um, what? <laughs> Goodbye, Calphite Queen. You can death mark the mole from across the map? Goodbye, Legio Primus. Rex Matriarch's done. I don't have a key to the crossing? How is that possible? Okay, well, oh my god. <laughs> All right, that's Reaper Crew done. I'm never going back to Yakka ever again. As you complete a Reaper Crew, you now have passive stats applied to you. Two prayer, 20 armor, 200 life bonus, 12 melee damage, 12 range damage, 12 magic damage, 12 necromancy damage. So basically, it's about a 1% DPS increase. Slow and steady wins the race team when you're on a hard crier, man. Although I would agree this is too slow and not nearly steady enough. No way! No way did I just get an Omni Guard! That's the best drop! Dude, I'm so lucky. I have 200 kill count. Okay, so this feels weird to do, but goodbye augmented tier 90 death guard to the garbage dimension. Goodbye. Wait, I got undead components from the disassemble. So now I can make siphons. So let's separate the pants. Goodbye. Put C4R3 back on them. Keep scavenging for looting because I'm going to put that on the power pants that we're about to make because I have one harmonic plate and I only need one for pants. Yes. No, no. <sighs> no, I didn't. I clicked on the wrong. I just separated them and then. <laughs> All right, let's try that again. Five minutes later. Wait, I got a level from that. C4R3 goes back on the pants. Scavenging Fort goes in the bin. Okay, we're good. My Vip Pot's on cooldown too. Oh my god. Whoo. Whoo boy. Oh my goodness. I've been gnomed. Oh, boss, I, I didn't. It's fine. <laughs> 115, new personal record. Okay, we've got a good rotation now. Okay, for, for Hellhound and tank gear, I feel pretty good about that actually. Look at that pre-phase! All right, ready? Go. Oh, and I crit? Oh, he's gonna die right here. I'm not even moving. See you, idiot. <laughs> that was so sick.
PR? Come on. Let's go, dude. Nice little kill time. 111. Okay, we're getting faster. That's really sick. That is my 300th grass deal kill. So we haven't had anything in 102 kills, which is okay, by the way. I'm just... I'm stating a fact. I'm not complaining. I I know. That is level 109 Necromancy coming in. Yeah, I got to restart my client after the instance. We lagging. No way! A third lantern? Almost a PR. <gasps> no way! What? I... I have two Omni Guards and three Lanterns and two Armor Pieces. What is going on? I I have no use for this. Like absolutely no use for this. What? Like I'm so under drop rate for armor and I'm like 12 times over drop rate on weapons. This is absurd. <laughs> oh, whatever. Boss side, I didn't. Any droppers? <gasps> Let's go, dude. Hand wraps coming in. I am two drops off the full tier 95 set. Holy moly. We are actually monstrous. I, we are having such a good experience at the first Decker Mancer, so risking it all in the hardcore. I have done 386 kills. Look at these weapons. That is insane. I'm right on drop rate for armor and I'm so over the drop rate on weapons. All right, let's keep it going. Honestly, I want more. My hunger is insatiable. My thirst, unquenchable. My spoon, literally so big I'm having trouble carrying it. I jinxed myself. Goodbye. That was a great kill. Oh my god! No, we got our first dupe. Well, okay, it's not really our first dupe. It's our third dupe, but our first dupe our piece. I'm okay with it. It's, it's expected. It's expected. Can we rename them to footsie wraps or... Tootsie Rolls. What? At this point, I decided to take a break from Raziel to get myself some more crushed nests from the Arch Glacier so that we could continue to make Sardome and Bruise so that I have food to kill more Raziel. And I was absolutely not expecting this to happen. Oh! What? Wait, what? Um... Bro, I'm trying to get Ness! What? I just want Ness so I can go back to rest. I didn't even switch my preset. Normal Wood Glacier is the second best source of crush nests in the game, but the best method by a long shot is hard mode. But hard mode Arch Glacier is not to be underestimated on a hard crying man because it is one of only two bosses in the game where you cannot teleport out of which means if I were to run out of divine charges or mess up something in my preset, I would have to either clutch up the kill or I would die. And the same goes with any kind of lag or disconnect. Because there's no teleporting out, my ring of life also won't activate. So choosing to head into hard mode here is extremely spooky, but it's something we're gonna have to do eventually anyway, so I'm willing to risk it. I haven't had any kind of disconnect in about two months, so hopefully the good luck can persist at least for enough time to get me some crush nests so that I can finish this Raziel grind. Enable hard mode for the first time ever. Okay, and that's the right prayer, oh man. I should use the tracker, actually. Okay, good first kill. You stream my process. We got free boss. Wow, I got spirit seeds. All right, continue. All right, he didn't die. Did I win? Bang. Ness 780. <laughs> Y'all are seeing this. <laughs> Instead of just like doing an hour normal mode for 100. <laughs> so should I take him and leave or should we go to 500? All right, 500 it is. We'll go for a title. I want to become a titled arch arch glacier. See, this is why this like we just we got to do this once and then we're good from here on out forever. You know what I mean? That's kind of the benefit to me. That was a really good kill time though. Holy moly. Oh my god. 2729 nests. I just realized I can use a mort and it's 100% safe. I am glad I did that, KN. Yeah. New new method unlocked for the beams. And more lasts for 20 seconds. Yeah, that's sick. And it doesn't require having a shield on. And it doesn't dismiss my conjurers. Yes, absolutely the play. <laughs> All right. Iceborne title complete. <laughs> of course I got an Econonix. Wait, we made 45 mil from that? <laughs> it's kind of obscene, honestly. And uh, 2,700 nests. All right, get in the bank, dude. Very worthwhile. I'm glad we did that. That was fun.
we're just gonna not continue with this because that was really bad okay any droppers oh my god what four four lanterns bro that's more lanterns than you need to light a minecraft house i don't need four lanterns i could put two in the front yard and two in the back dude my bank tab brighter than my future i think i'm cursed by these like I, I can't use them for literally anything. I am never going to have anything to do with them at any point. <laughs> Actually, they're not useless. Do you know why? Because when this video comes out, so many people are going to be getting angry at my RNG that it's going to help the algorithm. Actually got an algo boost. That is one hen necromancy. A big level 70% crit strike damage up from 65, I believe. All right, and the last thing we have to do is we've got to do our daily challenges. What? You know what? I actually think it's great that they've they've reduced the daily escape because to me, like, I, I don't want to feel pressure to log in every day, you know? I just think it's it's really, really good that there's no no pressure to log in every I only have five hours to do all this? Oh god, we gotta log in every day! Oh god, I gotta do all of these? There's a clock ticking! Chat, we're on the clock! Claim rewards! Claim rewards! Claim rewards! Claim rewards! Oh god, I'm level 21! What's going on? I'm gonna run out of time! You know what? I'm just gonna bond it. I'm just gonna bond it. I'm just gonna bond it. Where are the bonds? Got it! Click! Buy bond! Buy bond! Buy bond! Okay. I just don't want to run out of time. Good kill. Okay, that was the best kill of the day for sure. Or Calcum Salvage, and we can't forget the hero points. <laughs> Cannot forget the hero points. Oh my god, no way! That's five lanterns in 500 kills! Bro, what? Back to back? Thank god. No way! What? What are these weapons? I have no need for- look at this! That's my 500th kill! I am just so confused. All I'm gonna say is I apologize. Raziel, I'm gonna need your- Shirt in your pants, please. That's a PR. 108. Nicely done. Three seconds PR coming in. Ever since I started wearing the luck ring, I've stopped getting drops. This thing clearly doesn't work. Oh, no way! What? What am I going to do with six lanterns? Something's broken. Something's broken. Something's broken. Something's actually broken. Like, this, this does not make any sense. The game is broken. Don't call me Lantern Larry. Soulbound Samuel. This is like the Jagex equivalent of calling a hit on me. They're like, well, Ryan hasn't been harassed in a while. At the same time, I'm disconnected or something. What the hell is going on? Oh, uh, what was that? Is the server to everyone on 104? I had a thousand life points. Oh my God. That was so close to death. Should we look at the gravestones? Look at the ball. And you're gonna hang out, okay? What? That's my arm! I just like act 144k? Wait, look at that preface! That's nasty. I have never seen a preface like that. Okay, well, bye. I'm disconnected. Servers? Oh my god, I actually... If I hadn't tellied... Oh my god! If I hadn't tellied... Ooh, that is level 111 necromancy coming in. Not bad, not bad, not bad. I'm lagging. Well, that's fine. Well, I didn't. What is that? <laughs> it's the pet! Wait, let's freaking go! I have successfully stolen his cat! Now all I need is shirt and his pants. Any droppers? That's a no. You know what's crazy? Despite all of the like memes and stuff and getting the pet, because the pet's on a different drop table. We haven't actually had a main drop table drop in five hours of Razio. So that's good. My RNG is actually coming around a bit. Good to get a little dry streak once in a while. You know, we've had so many drops this boss. It just, it's nice just to feel something. That is my 700th Razio kill. 700 and that's not bad. That's, uh, that's honestly a decent number. And I don't think we've had a drop since 498. So that's good. 
Good little dry streak, other than the pet, which I'm not counting for the purpose of this exercise. Wait, is that a PR? It is 107.8. Look at the pace. All right, my aura has expired. So let's make the boss expire so my life doesn't expire. Let's go. Final kill of hour six dry. What do you got for your boss? I think it's time to give me stone spirits. No mementos. No crystal keys. All right, we go again. Had some repercussions. Oh, that is a bad way to end an eight hour dry streak. <laughs> it's a really tall beam though. I'll take a crown. Every king needs two, apparently. That is my 800th Raziel kill. So after a crazy streak of luck, I've had nothing but a crown in my last 302 kills, I think. 800 kills in though, feeling good. Working our way towards the uh, the pet reskin that doesn't exist yet, but maybe it will in the future. I would change a couple things about the drops. I wouldn't make them any like more common or more rare, but I would, um, I'd make it like archeology span relics. Whatever drop you'd most recently had, it was more likely that you'd get something that you you didn't have yet. So it's not like they drop in order, but the waiting changes over time. Because the like edge case people that have had seven hand wraps and no tops or bottoms, and it's like, that feels a little ungood. That was a good last phase. Oh no, I, I was just, I did this to myself. <laughs> that is level 112 necromancy coming in and we are combat level 146 now. All right, here we go. This is Razio kill 900. Holy moly, 900 kill count. Wait for the pop-up. I don't know why it's so delayed at this bus. There we go. And the PVMer keeps PVMing. Nice. Good little kill. <laughs> what? A seventh one? Bro, seven lanterns. No topper legs and seven lanterns? I don't have a name change. Uh, I was gonna make my name Tall and Moth. <laughs> But uh, stop calling me Lantern Larry. That's hurtful. A thousand kills in. No top or legs. Unless we get both of them right now. It, it didn't happen. Can we wait for the pop-up? In three, in two, in one. Bad build, no preface. You kind of hate to see it. I'll be fine. I'm not going to perish. I don't have stacks either. Oops. Everything is bad. Oh, whatever. The only thing that isn't bad is the loot. Just kidding, the loot is also bad. This is a really funny log. I'm sorry. This isn't like the luckiest or the least lucky log, but it is It is one of the funniest logs that you could have. It really is quite hilarious. Noice. That is one 13 necromancer coming in. That's actually kind of cool. Whoa, again? Dude, this boss is so much harder after the skulls change. I have ring of life twice now in the last hour after not ring of lifing in a thousand kills before the change. That is my 1100th Raziel kill without a single close call. Right, everyone? Did I win? No. Okay, people watching on YouTube, ignore apparently saying the guzzle goat. You can look at the gratzes. Three, two, and two, but no top or legs. All right, keep going. That is my 1200th Raziel kill. Dude, look at this overlay. Look at it cook. This is one of the tastiest overlays I have ever consumed in my life. This is like Waffle House on steroids. Okay, surely drop. I've started to forget what the drops even look like. I'm not even kidding. It's been 74 years. That is one 14 necromancy coming in. It's huge. That is my 1300th Razziel kill. Help. Okay, this is actually insanity. Look at all the... Dude, this is ridiculous. Herblor, are you guys ready for a huge XP drop? In three, in two, in one. That's so sick. And now we're 300k off 107. Here we go. Did I win? All right, come on, Razziel. Not what I meant. No, my salvage. 
It's Chover! Dude, Kenzie, are you kidding me? I thought that was mine! It was the same game tick! After four days dry, that really got me. It's the exact same game tick. No. Four days? I grinded four days for a fourth crown. Uh, pain. We go again. You know what? It's better than nothing. That will be a, a nice, tasty drop trade. Yes! Oh my god, yes, okay. It's been a thousand kills since the long progress. It's been like three weeks. We're not even done with this stupid boss. But I'm just so happy. Okay, and now we're one drop off. Oh, good lord. <laughs> Oh my goodness. That is a fourth Omni card, I think. Yeah, I think I'm okay with that. Half like four, it just means I can drop trade another one. All right, yeah, that's money. That is level 116 augmentation. That is my 1,800th Rizzler kill. Holy moly, this guy Raziels. That is level 116 Necromancy. Let's go to bed or go to a different boss, please. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> I might try that. So really all it takes is is me cooking. I just need to cook. Awesome, crown number five. Perfect. You might be wondering, wait, Ryan, crown number five. How come you only have four? Uh, there was an incident where I thought that they DA'd into undead components. So I, I may have disassembled it. He doesn't talk very much. Oh my god, I almost died. Okay, maybe don't do that. That is my 1900th Razio kill. Awesome. I love this boss. I can't wait to do more. <gasps> wait, Miss Apocalypse just got the title. Wait, she did it at 3,100 kills. That's what I want. How can I have that? Another rope. Okay, there have been on this world there have been five rogue bottoms today. That could have been mine. All right, keep going. Yo man just got one too. What the hell? Will our Orwellian adventure come to a cl- Nope. Pain. Stop getting rogue bottoms. Sorry, I'm fine. I'm not upset. Nope, not upset. Never been upset in my life. Everything's good. I am any droppers. Next kill. That is my 2,000th Raziel kill. Awesome. I am Pantsless Percival. It didn't work. All right, welcome to the catfish arc. Okay, that sounds like something else. Not that kind of catfish arc. That is level 118 inventation. That is 2,100 Raziel kills. That is level 117 Necromancy coming in. We're, we're gonna hit 120 without title. It's like actually really happening. That's crazy. At this point, I'm approaching 2,300 Raziel kill count, and I'm kind of starting to lose my mind. I've been at it for over a month of going in every single day and just grinding, and it's extremely demotivating. The fact that by kill count 300, I was only missing two items, and now in the 2,000 kill count since, I've only had one item that I needed. But a promise is a promise. And I promised you guys at the beginning of this video that we are not gonna give up until it's done. So let's finish it right now. Why are we still here? I don't know. I mean, to be fair, today doesn't really matter if we get a drop or not. You know, I'm only live for a couple hours. We're chilling. It's gonna be good. I'll just look for the shortest dude at the bar. Hey, I did not agree to meet up with you just for you to bully me on the internet and then bully me in person. Yes! Come on! Wow, come on, get in! Get me the Bruh. out of here! Oh my god, it's been a month! It's been a month! Wow, get in! He's free! It worked! Boom! I can't believe it! My heart is pounding! I... I'm free! What a stupid boss! I actually...
actually don't hate the boss, but the... Oh my god, the drop mechanics. I free! <laughs> okay, so we augment the pants. Zami, we're not doing. I don't, I don't need Zami for the next combat style. So the goal in this account is to get best in slot of every style. Do I have a death card EOF? I do. But yeah, so because of that, my next combat style to complete is gonna be magic. Thank you all so much for watching this video. These longer form videos take an absolute ton of time to make. So if this is the kind of content you like to see, let me know in the comment section down below. Outside of that, I am super excited for the next arc on this account because things just continue to get better and better. I'll see you guys in the next one where I'm gonna take my hard cry Iron Man to Solak and try to get Aerithor's Grimoire. Or maybe I'll just die trying.